Have you ever been somewhere and you see a plant and you don't know what it is? Or have you ever been at a nursery and they haven't labeled the plant that you want so that you can buy more of them or know if it's the same plant that you already own? If you've never used Google Lens, it allows you to take pictures and through facial recognition, or in this case, object recognition, determine what it is and give you search results showing you more information. This is great in the world of plants because either it can identify a plant you don't know or it can help you identify the variety of a plant you may have and want to match. To use Google Lens, you'll need to install the Google app. Here on iPhone, you go to the App Store, type in Google, do a quick search, open and install the app. Open the app and click on the lens icon in the search bar to start the viewer. Once you've got the viewer open, go take a picture of whatever plant you want to have more information on. Once you do that, Lens will determine what the item is and bring you up search results. And as you can see here, it came up with aloe vera. Let's try again on my red geranium. Yep, got it right. And this verbena? Turns out it's a verbena. When I went to buy this hosta, it just said assorted on the label, so I'm not real sure which variety it is. This was really helpful determining what exactly I have so I can go buy more of them. Same thing with this crepe myrtle. I have no idea what type of crepe myrtle it is. There's so many of them, but according to this, I may have a Miami crepe myrtle. No, it didn't get it right 100% of the time. It really struggles whenever you have too many different things in the photo. So in this particular example, it didn't quite pick up the coleus. On a second try, I isolated the coleus in the picture, and sure enough, it found it. It also couldn't tell a pepper from basil, which could be dangerous if you want one and not the other. Anyway, I hope this was helpful, and my apologies for the cat purring on half the audio. What can I say? He's a happy little dude. Bye, y'all!